Just like hacking machines, you can now hack your biology also. If you know the techniques to hack your biology and psychology, you can create a better version of yourself. Hi, this is Sajeev Nair. I'm a peak performance coach and a serial entrepreneur. In fact, I'm more excited to introduce myself as a wellness evangelist and a biohacker. My journey of wellness started way back in 2000 when I associated with one of the leading nutritional supplement companies. To, till that time, whenever I thought about health, I used to think about hospitals, doctors, clinics and all those kinds of things. But now I got open to a new world of wellness where we can prevent diseases to happen in the first place. Inspired by the knowledge I gained in the field of wellness, I co-founded a hospital, Wellness Solutions. My association with Dr. A. Sri Kumar, who is the chairman and also who is the founder of Indian Nutritional Medical Association, who is the chairman of uh, Wellness Solutions and other med medical practitioners associated with Wellness Solutions, enhanced my way of thinking, my knowledge about biology, my knowledge about neuroscience. In 2006, I got another breakthrough in my life where I got a chance to visit the US and I was uh, visiting one of the nutrigenomics facilities in uh, US. And that is the time I came to know about, for the first time, there is something called nutrigenomics exist. That means based on your genetic deciding on the nutrition what is required. So that was a great eye-opener for me, in fact. Till that time, I used to sell all different kinds of nutritional supplements. But when I came to know that each person's requirement about nutrition and food differs based on their genetics, it was a completely new world for me. In fact, during the same time, I ventured into a research project Thought Process Reengineering. What inspired me to get into this project which is based on neuroscience is because of my experience in the motivation and the people transformation field. I thought if I understand more about the way brain functions and make people aware about how to operate their brain in a better way, I can help people to achieve peak levels of performance. How were all these kinds of things, the kind of associations I had at that point of time, the research I did and also the kind of awareness I was gaining in the field of wellness made me to realize one thing, that if someone really wants to hack his biology, he can. If someone really wants to hack his neurology or neuroscience or neurochemistry, he can. This process is called biohacking. It may sound a bit technological, but what exactly is biohacking? Biohacking is taking charge of your biology and also psychology by influencing and making significant modifications in your internal and also external environment using scientific methodologies and techniques. And this is being done with a very clear-cut objective of making a sharper, faster, smarter and a better version of yourself. Though biohacking sounds like a more of western, modern and technological word, this is something which we have been practicing in India for the past so many years. In fact, I would rather say that for the past 5000 years or more. Hence, the relevance of biohacking is more in this part of the world than any other part of the world because we know the fundamentals, the basic science of biohacking or our ancestors have been practicing this fundamental science of biohacking from years together. Now, I'm sure that after listening to this, you also may be thinking that how can I take charge of my biology? How can I take charge of my psychology to create a better version of myself? Yes, you can. That the most important thing is that you need to believe that you can take charge of your biology and psychology. You can biohack. This is something which you need to believe first. And number two is that you need to take a very strong commitment and also decide exactly what you really wanted to achieve in your life in terms of your biology and psychology. Once you have defined that, then step by step, you may have to do a lot of experiments on yourself. Not dangerous, simple, but Every day through observation you can improve. Every single day you can improve your life. I have been practicing and I have been experiencing this for the last couple of years. I'm no more the same person who was there maybe three years back in terms of physiological condition and also psychological condition. Because in life I have come across certain challenges from that. I learned a lot of things and to come out of that I really had to empower myself. And that is the reason why I chose to biohack myself. In the coming videos, I'll be sharing with you a few simple, logical and scientific biohacking tips which you can practice in your life so that you can create a better version of yourself. Thank you.